Florence's foal, Angus, is now a week old. And today, it seems he's about to witness the most remarkable moment of his young life. After a wait of 13 months, Nadine is finally going into labour. But she appears to be struggling. Every single birth is different, so it could happen that the foal is in the wrong position. It could be that the foal is too big, so it can't come out properly. And mum will be pushing and pushing and nothing will happen. It could be that it's a stillborn. It's all a jeopardy. Her two and a half year old daughter, Merida, is staying close. There's not a lot I can do. I can see she's uncomfortable. If you could just tell them, you know, it's going to be all right, you know, just to take it easy. I think literally she'd kick me out if I started touching her and, like, helping her. Half an hour later, Nadine's foal finally makes its appearance. But the keepers are concerned that Nadine hasn't stood up. Nadine doesn't look very... I don't know if it's completely out, but Nadine is flat out on the yard. Like, she's hardly, like, Merida hasn't left her mum's side. Dad, Mac, can only watch on from his neighbouring field. Minutes later, Nadine finally struggles to her feet and encourages her newborn to do the same. Aww. Legs everywhere. It's doing really well. Oh. <laughs> the rest of the herd are curious to meet the new foal. But Nadine is very protective. For older daughter Merida, the arrival of two new foals means her world has changed forever. She's going to have to learn the hard way that she's no longer mum's number one because obviously Newfall will be and Nadine won't have time for Merida and that can be quite harsh to watch because it's tough loving. It's part of life and that's what we do. We grow up, unfortunately. <laughs> Oh. <laughs>